Okay, so naturally when you become a Twitch streamer, a lot of people start a Discord channel as well. And part of the reason why is because this gives you a place that your community can hang out when you're not live. It also gives you a place to communicate with your community and things like that. Well, in today's video, I'm gonna be covering a very specific question that I've been getting here more recently, and that is a feature that we have added in our Discord on the Eagle Garrett channel. And our Discord is called The Flock. And in our community, we have a thing where whenever somebody goes live who's a part of our community, in our Discord, it actually puts them into a role or a category that shows when they're streaming live. And so in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to set up a bot to do this for you automatically so that whenever somebody in your Discord goes live, you can actually show that they're live in your Discord and other people can check out their channel. It's a way to help build community and to help support one another and, and all kinds of good stuff. So with that being said, let's jump into it. I'm gonna show you how to make this uh, work and what bot you should be using in your Discord channel. Okay, and before we jump into the rest of the video, I do want to remind you guys, as always, I stream live on Twitch almost every day, so you can check me out there. The link is in the description for my Twitch channel at twitch.tv slash eaglegarrett. So swing by, hang out, ask me some questions in the chat, or just, just come relax and enjoy some gameplay uh, anytime you'd like. We'd love to have you over there and have you join the Flock community on my channel. With that being said, let me show you how this works, guys. Let's jump over into the computer. And uh, the first thing that I want to show you guys is this bot right here. This is called the Yag PDB bot. And uh, this is what I use to do this. Um, I don't use this bot for a lot of other things, although it has a lot of other features. But uh, anyway, this is a very, very cool bot. And let me just show you kind of what we're trying to do. Uh, if I open up my Discord channel here, you're gonna see over here on the right side that I have this currently streaming section. And uh, you can see that I've got three different people in my community that are currently streaming right now. And uh, underneath their their name, it'll show, for instance, that they're streaming. Uh, and then the, the title, best costume yet. So uh, as you guys can see, it shows that these guys are all live. But this happens automatically. I don't have to automatically, you know, or I don't have to manually go in and put them in this currently streaming section. So how do we set this up? How do we make this work? Well, the first thing you're going to want to do is go look up this bot right here, the YAG PDB, uh, or the, the address. I'll put the address in the description of the channel, by the way. But it's yagpdb.xyz. That's the address to go to to get to this bot. And you'll land on this, this homepage right here. First thing you're going to want to do is go over to the control panel and click on that. And when you do, it's gonna bring you to kind of a control panel updates and that sort of thing. But you're gonna to wanna to log in using your Discord server. So you're gonna click that and uh, it's gonna have you It's gonna have you go ahead and log in with your email and stuff like that. So give me just a minute and I'll put that stuff in here and then we'll get logged in. Okay, so once you've typed in your login stuff and you've gotten uh, past that login screen, then what it's gonna do is it's gonna bring this up and ask you if you want to allow YAGPDB to access your Discord. You just hit authorize right down here. Uh, and it's gonna take you into your actual like dashboard and up here in the top right hand corner it'll say select server and so if you manage multiple discord servers this is where you're going to want to go in and select which one you want to to manage from here but we're going to choose the flock which is our discord server and it's going to bring us right into the back end of our discord now how do we set up this this streaming option where you can show when people are live streaming in your discord well the first thing you're going to want to do is come over here to the left side and go to notification and feeds and you're going to click on that, and it's going to bring up these options over here for general, Reddit, YouTube, streaming, and Twitter feeds. So we're going to go to the streaming category and click on that. And this is going to allow, uh, this is going to allow the bot to show when people who are in your Discord are streaming. Now, there is one caveat to this. Once you get this set up, and I'll show it here in a second to you, but people do have to connect their Discord account to their Twitch account for this to actually work for them. Uh, but... With that being said, here's how it works. You go down here and you announce, uh, you, you pick a channel that you wanna announce when people are streaming live. So go into your Discord and create a, uh, you know, a place where, like a promo section, for instance. I have a promo section set up. We have a place where it, can, it says promote your Twitch. And in this promote your Twitch category, this is where it will announce when people are live. So as you can see, all the people who go live that are part of our community, it announces it in here. So it actually shows when people go live. Now what you can see right here is that, take, take a look at this for a second. Buddy is now streaming live. Buddy is also over here on the right side, currently streaming. So I have a section set up here where he shows up and you can see everybody who's streaming and it's in purple to match Twitch. And then over here, it announces that they're streaming and gives a link to their channel, okay? 
So you set up a category um, or a, a place where it will announce when people are streaming. So we've got that set up as promote your Twitch. You come over here to the, uh, to the bot, you hit enable. You got to make sure that your bot is set to manage roles. And the way we do that is we come over to our Discord server and uh, you go into your, you right click on your Discord server. You go down to server settings, roles. And then you want to go to your YAG PDB bot that's going to show up right in here. So you go to that, you click on that, and you want this role to be set to where it can manage roles. So you want to set it to all kinds of stuff, like like uh, you want it to be able to move members and, and do things like that. So go ahead and up, you know apply most of these things to the bot, but make sure that manage roles is selected as an option for your YAG PDB bot. Uh, it's hard to say that all like back to back to back to back. <laughs> Once you have this set up and it can manage roles, this will allow the bot to move people in and out of different categories or different roles. So once you have that set up, uh, now we're going to go back over to the website and we have it enabled. Okay. We're going to go and select which channel we want it to make that announcement. When people are streaming, we're going to pick what we want it to say when someone's streaming. Ours just says, our just says, Ka! and then it has their username and it says is currently streaming. Check out. Uh, check it out and then puts their URL. So you can change this. You can make this say whatever you want. Uh, the role, this is the channel it announces in. Currently streaming role, you need to actually create a role in your channel that you can select to have it show when people are, you know, currently streaming or where you want it to put them when they're streaming. So for instance, we went back over to our Discord bot and we created a role by right clicking on the flock, going back down to server settings, roles. We created a new role. Uh, by hitting the little plus button up here and when we did that we created the currently streaming role and uh, And it displays role members separately from online members You want to make sure that that's checkmarked on because what that allows it to do is Pull people out of wherever they are and show on that right side that they're currently streaming So when you have that selected, it's gonna show over here when people are in that category so we selected that and then let's go back over to the website here. Uh, we selected currently streaming under the currently streaming role, the one that you want it to show in. You can name this whatever you want, streaming or, or live or whatever you want it to be. Uh, and then hit uh, save streaming settings. And once you've done that, you're set up, you're ready to go. So you can come back over to your Discord and you can check right over here. And now all people have to do is connect their Discord channel to their Twitch account. And if they're a member of your Discord, it will show them up in the currently streaming section. It'll also show them in your whatever promote section that you've set up. It'll announce that they're streaming. And you don't have to set up a promote section if you'd rather not have it do this. Uh, but a promote section is a good way for people to come in and say, hey, I'm streaming. This is my channel. Check me out. And, uh, and that way, when people want to promote themselves, they're not cluttering up your general feed or any of your other feeds. They, they go right to this section. Everyone knows this section is for self-promotion if you're okay with that kind of thing in your Discord for that specific section. But the coolest part and the part that I think most people ask me about is this currently streaming on the right side right here. This is really cool because when people go offline, it automatically takes them out of that role and puts them back into whatever other role they have. If they're part of your, you know, your sub community, if they're part of your, uh, you know, your followers community, it takes them out of this currently streaming and puts them back into an, whatever, wherever they came from originally. Now, I want to show you one other thing here. Uh, what people need to do to make this work, and people will ask you this quite a bit, they'll say, hey, how do I get into the currently streaming category? Like, how, how do I become a Twitch streamer in your Discord? Well, what they have to do is go down to this little gear in the bottom left-hand corner and click on user settings. They need to go to connections right here at the top, and then they need to connect their, uh, their Discord to their Twitch account. So they're gonna need to go up here to the Twitch button. They're gonna need to click on that and connect their Twitch account. Um, so when you click on that, it's going to start connecting it. I don't want to, I've already connected it, but, uh, you can see that I'm already connected to Twitch right here, uh, display on profile. It displays my Twitch account right here on my profile. And you can see all the other servers that I'm a part of and things like that. But the main thing is they have to make this connection to their Twitch account or this will not work for them. Cause there's no way for the bot to know when they're live unless their Twitch account says, hey, we're live. And the bot says, okay, I'm gonna move you into the currently streaming category. So make sure they come over here to connections, they click on Twitch and they connect their Twitch account to their Discord. Once you've done that, you're set up and ready to go. That's how you set up this bot in your Discord. 
and uh, and how you can show people over here to the right side who are streaming and help get that kind of community support going for one another's streams. So hopefully, guys, you found that as a helpful video uh, for you and your Discord. Um, this was something that was actually shown to me by one of my friends on Twitch. His name is Red Seal. He set this up first, and I was like, dude, that is amazing. Please tell me how, how you did that. And so he directed me to this bot, and I went through and kind of figured out how to set it up and stuff. And it's really not hard once you figure out what all needs to happen. And, uh, and so we set it up and we've been doing it ever since. And uh, a lot of people have asked me about it and how to add it to Discord. So with that being said, you guys, hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you like this video and if you like this content, smack that subscribe button so you'll know when more videos get posted. Smack the like button if you liked it. And of course, smack that notification bell uh, to know when more videos are posted on this channel. Guys, my name is Eagle Garrett. Uh, again, I do stream live on Twitch. So twitch.tv slash Eagle Garrett. Come check us out. We'd love to have you with us. We're also on Twitter. Uh, you can come check me out there. I'm pretty active on Twitter, so say what's up. I'm on Instagram, pretty active uh, on Instagram. I need to post more probably, but you know, there's a lot of stuff. And then of course on Facebook, uh, we'd love to see you there as well. Guys, links in the description for everything we just talked about, including this bot. And with that being said, you guys rock on, peace out, God bless, and I'll see you in the next video. Yeah, I got that guy in the corner. He was camping it. Oh, guy tried to come out of the uh, the tunnel and I got him, bro. One more, one more. Another guy. Got him. Oh, come on, give me a VTOL jet. VTOL jet activated, let's go. Oh dude, I'm 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 all to the pistol now.